Hey fellow adventurers, in this episode, we are going to be playing The Riftbreaker. It is a base building survival game with action RPG elements to it, where we have to fend off swarms of alien attacks. This game is being developed by XR Studios and is set to release sometime later this year. So let's check it out. Roger that, begin field base setup. Uh oh. Rift Breaker. Alright. Okay, let's start with the prologue. Rift oh. successful. Nice. Sensors online, weapons activated. We're ready to go. Rift Breaker okay. Novak, please report. Houston, oh. this is Ashley. Reporting rift jump successful. Nice. Roger that. Begin field base setup. Ashley, construct a headquarters building to secure our presence here. It will allow me to reconstruct if my armor is destroyed. All right. We don't have enough carbonium to build an HQ. Let's okay. scout for a deposit and set up our base close to it. We need to move quick. It's probably a matter of time before the natives spot us. It says the resources we collect on the bottom right. We've located a carbonium deposit. Oh, nice. Okay. There it is. Move on to the deposit and start drilling. Oh. Jesus, man. We've gathered enough resources to construct a headquarters building. Okay. Finally. Let's place it close to a carbonium deposit. This will help oh. us speed up resource production. Okay. We'll place it right here then. I think this is good enough. So you have to basically click on the stuff before you can actually build the thing. Okay. HQ construction in progress. All right, let's Sometimes collect I wish we could fast more resources. Part of the simulation. Yeah, Captain definitely. Novak, let me remind you that even though this is a simulated training exercise, you are expected to perform as if it was your real mission on Galatea 37. Aye, aye, Major. We need to expand the base. Let's build a carbonium factory to do the digging for us. Oh. Okay, yes, carbonium factory. Yes, we've got factory. much more interesting things to do. Let's automate this. Um, okay, this is a carbonium factory. Yes, this should be fine. All right. Our base will require huge amounts of power to operate. Right now, we can only construct some basic power plants, wind turbines, okay. and carbonium power plants. Wind turbines are less effective, but they work around the clock. Carbonium power mm -hmm. plants are very effective, but they use up the deposits that they are placed on. In the beginning, oh. it's best to use a combination of these power sources. We can balance energy peaks and shortages by storing excess energy in energy storages. Also, remember to connect all buildings to the power grid using energy connectors. They connect all buildings within their area of operation, even if power lines are not visible. Yep. Alright then, I'll just make some wind turbines over here. Yep, this should be fine. Ashley, I'm detecting a lot oh. of movement to the west. We should build up a defensive perimeter around the base. Okay. Let's set up some walls and sentinel towers. Focus our defenses on the western direction. They never sentinel changed the tower. beginning of this exercise. Captain Novak, we all know your renowned scientific background, but your combat performance in the previous simulation was far from spectacular. Slaughtering indigenous creatures was never my area of expertise. Since you've already done this a couple of times, we've introduced some new additions to this course. We'll see what your area of expertise really is. I need some AI cores. 
Um, I also need some carbonium because I need those for the walls. Um, let's see. Let's build some more walls. Oh! Jesus. <laughs> okay, the guns is pretty the gun is pretty nice. Jesus, okay, they can shoot too. Oh, my shields are gone. But they regenerate over time, so I should be fine. Get off my lawn, you damn aliens! Hmm, can we actually make some sentinel towers here? I think we can. Good, good. Okay, we need more carbonium for this. Let's set up a wall. So we need some AI hubs to make AI, AI chips which in turn give us sentinel energy. towers and we also need some power plants in order to power them up. Let's just farm some carbonium, make some wind based power plants and then we'll make some AI hubs. We need to connect the thing right down here too. Okay, it's connected. These basic defenses should give us nice. a security, but we should try to surround our entire base with walls and defensive towers. Ashley, I strongly advise you to construct an armory. It will allow us to craft new weapons and upgrades, okay. and also manufacture field repair kits, as well as other usable items. And it will armory. produce more ammunition for your guns. Yes, that is okay. an important building. We are making an armory. Let's uh, farm more carbonium. Carbonium is the most important resource so far. Armory construction finished. We can now use it to craft new items. It will also okay. automatically manufacture ammunition for my weapons. Nice. Oh, we found more carbonium. Good, 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 good. Let's set up a carbonium mine here. Okay. Ashley, we should further secure and expand our base. You can build more defenses. Are you saying I'll have to fight more damn aliens? To prevent further attacks. We didn't have any time to study the creatures that are attacking us. The only thing we can do right now is to fight them or strengthen our defenses. We'll need a steel factory to build more towers. We'll have to find an ore deposit to build one. Okay, we need steel factory, so... Solid ironium factory. Okay, we need some carbonium before we can do that. Our power consumption is going up, so... We need another power plant. I guess we can make one here. Okay, this should this should give us enough energy. Okay, this should give us some stable supply of um, carbonium while we do other things. Okay, so let's go check out what's on the east side. Oh! Okay. This looks like a Holy Jesus, the aliens are here. Okay. We can do that. Okay, perfect. Now we are producing enough energy, we are also getting enough 
Ironium. Let's see what else there is to explore. Warning. Hostile creatures are coming from a nearby nest. We should go there and clear it out. My name is Ashley, and I'll kill all of you alien scum. Don't mesh with me! Okay. Where are these fuckers? Okay, got them. Base is under attack. Dude, are you serious? They're destroying my shit? Oh, I should have gone destroyed their nest. Base is under attack. Of course, they're attacking my iron emers. Uh, can I repair this? Okay, I'll have to go destroy the nest. Because they're gonna be a problem. Sooner or later. We got more carbonium here. This Come here, like bitches! I got you! Let's look inside to see if it's occupied. Yes, it is. Oh, yeah. He was good, man. Give me that animal biomass. Yes, I'm destroying the nest. Fuck you. Good shit. This will decrease the strength of their attacks. Nice. Let's gather all the research samples and rare resources that were in this nest. We can study okay. them later and use them to craft better equipment. Oh. Destroy Canopetric's nest to the north. Okay, we can do that too. There's more than a single species of creatures around this nest. We should be careful. Damn, boy! Jesus, that's a lot of them. Okay. That was a lot of them. I need to restore my health. Okay, it's automatic. Good, 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 good. Let's go destroy this nest. around here they appeared as if all of them were working together against us i wonder if oh. that's just a part of the simulation or if the galatean creatures are really going to be that smart that would make studying them much more interesting and much more dangerous i bet it looks like we've cleared them out let's hope this will give us some time to build up our base Sentinel nice powers are ready they should be able to fend off small groups of attackers. Select any of the available rift portals to instantly teleport to that location. Oh, Traveling nice. Rift is almost instant and doesn't consume any resources. Okay. They need some energy. Okay, let's make some I'm detecting hostile creatures heading towards our new mining outpost. Okay. They're not going to give us a break, are they? Let's make more of this. A tower has been destroyed. A 
Come on, man. Why do you keep attacking my small farms, man? I didn't do anything to you. Okay. They destroyed my shit. We defended the mining base, but I'm sensing another attack heading towards our headquarters. We should return there quickly. Okay. The HQ has a permanent rift portal. We can rift jump to its location at any moment. Let's go. I am. Oh, they're up there. Okay, I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. Base is under attack. Yes, I can see that, Ashley. Are you kidding me, dude? Jesus, that's a lot of them. Holy fuck. Air humidity is rising. It's going to rain in a moment. Okay. Warning. Does that concern me? I'm detecting a huge swarm of enemy creatures heading towards our base. It's showing up on my seismic detectors. It's much bigger than anything we've seen before. Okay. We don't have much time. We have to set up as many defensive towers as we can. Also remember to build up more walls and lay all the mines that we can. It's raining. It will decrease the output from solar panels until it stops. Warning! More enemies are heading towards our base. Threat level maximum. I'm disabling oh. all secondary systems and diverting all power to your guns. It's either us or them. Oh! They just spawned on me. I come in peace, I come in peace, I come in peace. Please don't kill me. Don't break my shit. Situation critical. I'm removing all power to life preservation systems. Okay. There's too many of them. We're getting overrun. No. You weren't meant to survive this final attack wave. Okay. Serve as a reminder that you should never underestimate the threat that you may be dealing with. Even if you think you are. I'm pretty sure I could have during this training session. Gotten rid of this threat. You can start preparing for your trip to Galatia 37. All right guys, that was fun. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Let me know in the comments below what did you think about the game. If you guys are new to the channel, you can also subscribe to it for more similar content. And thanks again for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Till then, take care, stay safe, and I hope you all have a great day.